in our sustainable growth program, we have mo many systems. One of them is our cohesion system. Uh, and that's a, a little softer system. It's about how everyone works together. And, and we base a lot of our work off of Patrick Lencioni's work in one of his great books early on. One of the, it was the first book I read of his was Five Dysfunctions of Team, in which he says, you know, a team, to be a true cohesive team, needs to trust each other uh, so that they can have healthy conflict, so that there's good commitment because they've had that healthy conflict and they can hold each other accountable with team accountability to get team results. And they each build on each other and it all starts with trust. And so we hear that word trust a lot and we, we know that there's this, this phrase of, I don't trust somebody or boy, they're not a trust, trustworthy person. But what do we mean by that word trust? And there's a lot of dimensions to trust. We can, we can think through that, you know, somebody's not, we can't trust them because they're not reliable. If we ask them to do something, uh, they just might not get it done on time. And, and we could say that there's somebody we don't trust. Like they say they're going to do it, but they have no intent of doing it. They're not very honest. Uh, there's not a lot of honesty in, in them. I don't trust them because of their honesty. We can say I don't trust them because even though they said they're going to do it, why they're going to do it, I don't think is of good intent. I don't think they're doing it out of goodwill. And, and then there's like, I don't trust them. Like, I don't think they're, they don't even know how to do it. I don't even think there's competency to do it. And if you can work through those and be aware of what you're really trying to do as a team and you want to draw, co draw cohesion as a team, you're going to get to know each other. You're going to challenge each other. I said that that trust grows into conflict. But if a team is going to grow, it's all based on this last layer of trust, which is vulnerability, right? Vulnerability-based trust is the only trust that really allows you as teammates to, to challenge each other because you know that the other person is going to be open. They're going to be vulnerable. They're going to let their underbelly show, right? And, and they know that if you've got their back, um, we'll work together. And when you're giving me that feedback about trust or about any of those elements, um, I'm going to take it that you got my back and you're doing it for my good, for the good of the team, and ultimately the good of team results. So we'd love to talk you through... Uh, the five, uh, uh, the five behaviors of a, of a high-functioning team. We'd love to work with you on some of these trust pieces. We've got a, a couple tools that we would use, a, a couple assessments that we would share with you. Uh, and if you're interested, uh, click down below uh, on the button to learn more, or even click the Let's Talk button and schedule a meeting with me, uh, and we can just talk through to see if there's a fit on any of that or if there's any just simple tools we could get you. Looking forward to talking to you soon.